Sometimes you can see Korean people in American movie, but you might speak Korean better than actor himself. Nairobi에서는 친구들이 부자예요. She speaks so good Korean. 대단해요. Hi guys, it's Wonji who teach Korean in fun ways. Today we're gonna watch one of the scenes in Black Panther and learn what is a real Korean accent. If you're struggling for Korean pronunciation, let's practice together. Are you ready? Let's go. Oh, it's size music. Oh, it's so fun. Oh, very fancy car. This way. Hwe to ge yo. Hwe to ge yo. is a Korean word for the raw fish. Here, they use ke which is a counter for general things, but I recommend you to use mari because mari is a counter for animals. And you can see the raw fish here, so we're more precise to use mari than ke. Two? Two? You might heard there are two number systems in Korean. One is Korean and the other is Sino-Korean. Pure Korean number are 하나, 둘, 셋, 넷, 다섯, these are used for counters like counting things, animals, age, glass, bottle, so many things. But you should be careful when you use Korean number because they change their form with the counter. For example, when hana combined with ke, it become hange. Du is combined with ke, it become duge. Set combined with ke, it become sege. Net combined with ke. It become 4개. 다섯 combined with 개, it become 5개. 1, 2, 3, 4 change their form, but you can keep the original form from 5. Sophia, 아줌마. Sophia, 아줌마. Sophia, 아줌마. 아줌마 is a title for middle aged ladies. Be careful! It's informal title, so you can use only for the close people, not for strangers. In the movie, she was already friend with a lady, so she could call her ajumma. But if you go to Korea talking with a seller, you shouldn't call her ajumma. Instead, I recommend you to use emo, which is a word for auntie. <gasps> she speaks so good Korean. 얼굴 보니 좋네요. 얼굴 보니 좋네요. 얼굴 보다 is literally looking the face. 얼굴보다 has stronger meaning than just 보다. We use this especially when you haven't seen someone for a long time. You can emphasize how much you miss a person, so you can use 요즘 얼굴 보기 힘들다, which means it's so hard to see you these days. 이 두명은 누구야? 이 두명은 누구야? 이 두명은 누구야? We learned the current number and counter, right? 명 is a counter for people. So you might remember when 두 is combined with counter, it become 두, right? So that's why it become 두명, not 둘명. And 누구야 is who is this? If you want to ask more formal, 누구예요? 누구예요? 나이로비에서는 친구들이 부자예요. 대단해요. I can see how much she practiced a lot. 나이로비에서 온 친구들이에요. 나이로비에서 온 친구들이에요. 에서 오다 means coming from. So if you want to say I'm from America, 저는 미국에서 왔어요. 저는 미국에서 왔어요. You can put your country before 에서 then you can introduce yourself anywhere, anytime. 좋은 분들이에요. 좋은 분들이에요. 분 is an honorific for calling someone very polite way. 분 can be another meaning, minute, so be careful not to be confused with honorific and the time words. Was it Korean? No way. Even though it was hard to understand, it was quite useful expression. 사고치기 좋아하는 애들이라고? 사고치기 좋아하는 애들이라고? 
사고 치다 is the expression for getting into trouble. 좋아하다 is to like and 에 is kid. So it literally means are you the kid who loves making troubles? If you know this kind of person, you can say 또 사고 쳤어? 또 사고 쳤어 means you did it again? Oh my god. 너 같이? 너 같이? 너 같이? 같이 is like, so it comes with anything you compare. Black, pink, 같이. 예뻐요. 아이. 아이. Korean people are quite famous with its own cuteness. It's called 애교. 아이. Can be, please be nice to me. Please do my favor. Asking for generosity. But if it is too much, it's better not use it. Like, oh, sorry. Kumawayo. 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 This is simply thank you. You can also say, Kamsaheyo. So you can choose when to use it. Today, we learn Korean with Black Panther movie. Do you feel more confident to speak Korean better than Korean asthma? If you enjoy studying Korean with me, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, so we can keep learning Korean fun with me. Let me know if you have any topic you're curious about, and see you next time. Bye bye!